Uh, welcome, welcome back, and I need help at C squared. In this example, we need to find these two limits, and I'm going to start with the first one. Limit when x approach to 1 minus over x minus 2 over x minus 1. So, the first thing you're going to do when you have a limit is to use the value given x approach to 1. We, get, we use that one and plug it in 1 minus 2 or 1 minus 1. And you notice here we have negative 1 over 0. So, this is an undefined form. But we can take a look and see, in fact, uh, uh, if we numerically, if we have a limit or not, it looks like we don't. So for that reason, I'm going to go with x equals, and this is 1 minus, number less than 1. So that will be 0 0.9. And what we get here is going to be 0. 0.9, 0 0.9 minus 2, over 0 0.9 minus 1. And that will be negative 1.1, and this one will be 0, negative 0 0.1. And if we do this division, we're going to get 11. But I'm going to go even closer to 1, like x equals 0.99. And I'm going to have a similar expression, 0.99 minus 2 over 0.99 minus 1. And this is going to be negative 0.01. I mean, in fact, uh, it's going to be 1.01. .01 negative over 0 0.01 and if we do the division we're going to get 101 and you notice once I get closer and closer to x the value I get out is larger and larger that is another way to see this limit does not exist it's a numerical way and in fact if you take a look here we can notice that this number is getting larger and larger it's a positive number, so we can say limit when x approach 1 minus of x minus 2 over x minus 1 is infinity or positive infinity. We're going to do a similar approach for the second limit. And you notice the second limit says limit when x approach to 1 plus value larger than 1. That is the meaning of x minus 2 over x minus 1. And again, you can do the same approach. You replace the 1 in the expression, and obviously we're going to get the same negative 1 over 0, which is undefined. But now let's see how much is the limit is in the, this case. So we have x equals and a large number, first number that is larger than 1, I will say it's 1.1. And we're going to have here a 1.1 minus 2 over 1.1 minus 1. So that will be um, negative 0 0.9 over 0 0.1 and that will be negative 9. Let's go even closer to um, 1. So I'm going to say 1.01. .01. I have a similar Expression 1.01 minus 2 over 1.01 minus 1. And how much is this uh, expression? This is going to be 0.99, negative 0.99. And this one is going to be 0 0.01. So that will be 99. And you notice here, once I get closer and closer to 1, the value of the function is getting larger and larger. So we say here, limit when x approach to 1 plus of x minus 2 over x minus 1 is, I'm sorry, this is negative, negative infinity. Okay, we can see the same behavior in the picture. Once I get closer to 1 from the left side, the function is going up positive infinity once I go closer to 1 from the right side of the function it's 
coming from down here negative infinity if you enjoyed this little clip don't forget to click the like button and come back and see square for more help thank you